Right then, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Look, the BMW M3, convertible. Just landed with us for our next sale. Good reg as well, but just check with the girls that goes with it. Uh, I'm sure it will, but just uh, just double check. Um, but nice and tidy under the engine bay there, look, as you can see. Nice, tidy, clean engine, strut tops and things look good. Inner wings, etc. Sounding in all nicely intact. Bonnet lips and edges and things look nice. Once a BMW badge on the front there, look. A couple of age-related stone chips and bits and pieces across the lower valance, but um, as a whole, it looks looks a bright car. It won't... You what, sorry? I've only just started, I haven't yet. No, there are a little bit around the mirror caps and bits and pieces, look. Would benefit from a good polish. Yeah, that one's doing round there. Yeah, there's a few little bits which I'm sure I want dressing. Yeah, but, um... Yeah. yeah, a few bits on the top of the wings down there. I'm sure, I bet that other mirror as well, they tend to go there, don't they? Yeah, they're very common on there, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. But, um, no, it, it looks a looks a bright car, guys, but yeah, it is going to require a little bit in the near future. Do you want some TLC, Blesser? Yeah. Wheels and things will clean up well. But hopefully, a few it'll little, accordingly. Yeah, a few little bits around some of the arches. Interior-wise looks nice, though. Nice and tidy on the bolsters on the passenger side. Dash top and things look good. Once again, knob. Just general bits of wear and tear, really. But, um, no. Nearly a full no. toolkit. Yeah, there's a missing there. Oh, that's good. It's tidy enough in the boot, though, isn't it? Yeah, there you go. You're pumping things, etc. Toe still in there. Boot floor looks good. Have you been under the, yeah, you've been under the bonnet, haven't you? Yeah, I've been under the bonnet. I haven't operated the roof yet. So you won't put the arse off in it, so you have to take the arse off first. Yeah, we'll have to. Yeah, I ain't done any of that yeah, yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What have we got? 111 on there. 111 showing. Obviously, check it on out for yourself, guys. Electric seat working. Yeah. No faults on the dash. Headline has just dropped a little bit on the hard top, guys. When we get a minute. It's an entry level M3, isn't it? Let's just get it in perspective because they're they're up there and they're down there, aren't they? You know, you get a, either a banger, don't you, or you get a star car. And I think the best way to describe some of these, I think, just to give it like a, a full tow, just it's, a, it's just an entry level M3, isn't it? Let's just get it in perspective. You know, we're not trying to say it's a star car. You know, it's not a show car. It's just an entry level M3. So yeah, please come down, go through the paperwork. Just see what bits and pieces you need to improve to make it, you know, to take it to the level that you want and go from there. That's it, a very usable M3 for somebody. You know, it doesn't embarrass itself. But, um, no, there you go. So please do come down and have a look, guys. Obviously, just touch base with the, uh, with the girls in reception there with regards to paperwork. And um, I can let you know what we've got for it. Uh, and as I was saying, when I do get a chance, we'll, uh, we'll lift the hard top off. And Sorry, my voice is going. And uh, I'll just show you the uh, the roof and that. So um, yeah, there you go. But uh, more importantly, do come down, have a good look round, and uh, and see what you think.